You're live. All right, folks. So what we're doing is uh, we are setting limb lines, some limb lines today. So what we have uh, is not the, the thickest, but it's 65 pound braided line. And we're, this part is going to the tree. So it's going to be hooked on a tree, a branch. And what you actually want is something that's probably going to give a little bit, just like your rod would. We're going to come down and we're going to put a slip sinker on it. Uh, to kind of hold it down in the fish column a little bit and then we're going to run our line down a little further and we're going to put a barrel swivel uh, the fish get on there they start turning and twisting you don't want them to snap your line so we're putting the barrel swivel and then we're going to run several feet out and then we're going to put our circle hook and this is a uh, gamakatsu uh, octopus circle hook and it is a snailed hook. If you don't know how to snail your hook, I will leave a link at the end of this video uh, that'll show you how to do that. But there you go. And that's how we're setting these limb lines up today. Let's see what happens. All right, folks, we have some live action going on. And there it is. And yes, a flathead, a small flathead. We're doing something different today, folks. We are doing limb lines. Miss Tammy has never done it before, and I haven't done it in years. And uh, we had to fight for a while to get this one out. Then we miss Tammy. He and, uh, all around some tree limbs. Yeah, he got in all these roots and so on and so forth down in here and made life a little difficult. Look at that little chubby belly on him. Oh my goodness. We're going to get the hook out of him and let this one go. But uh, it's been a long day. He needs to be a lot bigger. Yep, needs to be a lot bigger. But it was fun. Okay, we got the hook out of him. I went through his gill to get it out yep. safely. And uh, we're going to release him back so he can grow up. There you and there go. he goes. Good job. All right, one down. Let's go check the others. <laughs> well, folks, the catfish weren't cooperating like I hoped they would. However, we had to show this episode due to the fact that this was Miss Tammy's first time ever, right, line, uh, limb line fishing, yes. right? And not only that, but she caught the coveted, right, flathead catfish. One of the hardest catfish to catch. That's what we got her first time out on a limb line. But this also gives us the opportunity to do what? Talk about our Jugging for Jesus campaign. That's not the one I was going for, but yes. Starting Jan uh, June 1st yes. is our Jugging for Jesus campaign. Uh, and we're going to leave a link at the end of this video also, so there'll be the snail to hook link and the jugging campaign that we're doing. National campaign, we need your help also. And this is so it will help other people. Yes, I'm losing my voice here, but it's important, so check that link out. And remember to send us your photos along with the information about who you donated the fish to so that we can put it all together into an episode. And we can say thank you to everybody. Exactly. And speaking of thank you, this is Memorial Day weekend. This is where I thought you were going earlier, but we're no. doing it now. To I'm all of our up. service people out there, thank past, you. present, and future, we want to thank you for your services, uh, your service, and your sacrifice yes. that you take on a daily basis uh, to protect this country and us. And again, we are remembering those this weekend who are no longer with us that gave the ultimate sacrifice uh, for our freedom. So thank you very much. If you're a veteran, we love you. We thank you and appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to subscribe. And uh, we've got a lot more coming up soon. Also, be safe on the water this weekend. It is a holiday. Absolutely. Take care. We'll see you soon.